Karen. She is so funny. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, and you the are sweetest so funny. Too. Yes. You, she is so full of just a, a wealth of love and knowledge. <laughs> I swear to God, at, at the table, every time she mentions something, I go and do it and I feel better. Like we were talking I, and yeah, she, give me was an like, example. I love she was this. like, uh, she was like, I have uh, this book of, of writing prompts. It's so amazing. It helps me. And she told me about it. I went out and bought it, and it's helped so much. Really? Yeah. Okay. Writing what? It's, a yeah. it's, it's just, called writing. Just writing Andrew, prompts. it's something you do in comedy to like <laughs> make people laugh. Yeah. I've never heard of it. <laughs> well. <laughs> I'm just off the top. I'm like KZ. No, kinda. that's, no, that's how you People call me the Jay Z of comedy. I, I'm, <laughs> no, they call you the lazy. Oh. Of Welcome back to the show. Ian Fidance is here. Welcome to the show, Ian. Thank you. Yay, I love you. I love you. Um, Andrew Collin. I love you. I, lo- I feel <laughs> similar. No, I love you, Andrew Collin. <laughs> You're a dear friend. And Mia Jackson is here. Uh, oh, Mia's yeah. half hour Comedy Central spe- stand up special, The Stand Up. This Comedy Central, The Stand Up Presents. I don't think that's the name of it. <laughs> I think it's just stand up. I think it's like. The hand, what is it called it's now? It's just Comedy Central Stand Up Presents. Oh, Stand Up Presents this Friday, November 1st at 11.30 p.m. on Comedy Central. Mia Jackson's first half hour for Comedy awesome. Central. Woo. So exciting. Um, when did you tape it? January. Oh, so this has been a long yeah. time coming. January. That's Where great. Where y'all t- New Orleans? New Orleans. Yeah. Oh, yes. that's fun. Mm-hmm. We're going there today. Yeah, we are. Oh, How are you feeling about that, buddy? I feel good. Yeah, we're going to oh. perform at Andrew Collins' old college. No, uh Yeah, which, that's which the only college? reason Tulane. I accepted the gig. Oh, okay. oh my yeah. God, that's yeah. so fun. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I told him just to ease up on, like, he. Th- I just, I think that Andrew's, like, thinks that everyone's, like, our boy is back, but he doesn't understand that all the undergrads don't give a shit about any alum. Yeah, yeah. Like, remember when you were an undergrad, like, yeah. and someone was like, I uh, used to go here. You're just like, who yeah. cares? Oh, yeah, man. someone played trumpet at our graduation that, like, graduated in 1978. We're like, who gives a fuck? Yeah, no. But I, it's everything yeah. to that person, and Andrew's, yeah. like, planning all these bits about oh, the, this cute. old dorm. And, this is where I found my penis cute to work. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Yeah. You're looking at me with such disdain right no, now. No, I'm not. So, yes, so, I so to, I Andrew's to going back to his alma mater. <laughs> Do you really? Uh, yeah, I have to shit. I, for, I should have shit there in the break. Do you want to go now? No, I can hold it in. You have to. Sh- I don't like knowing that you have to mm. shit. Well, yeah. I didn't want you to think I was mad at you. Yeah. But you really have to shit? <laughs> I don't know. You maybe. got in the chamber? You don't know? I mean, I can. Why do you not know? I do know. You should know. I yeah, can shit. Yeah, you should know. I can shit. Okay. Is how it going to be a lot? Is this going to take you a while? Like, how long do you spend on the toilet? I'm a very quick shit. You know I'm in and out. Oh, I don't oh. know that. Mm. Oh, well, now you do. Okay. Okay. Are you an in and outer? No, I like to take time. Oh, why? You look I like at your to, phone? I like to read. Yes. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah. Don't let your legs go numb. No, it's not, Me neither. not in there that long. Uh, Come yeah. on. Just a, enough time to get some, read a couple of articles, respond. Yes, newspaper. <laughs> yeah. Sitting around, yeah. catching Wait, up what? on the news. You bring I a don't paper like in? Sitting there for yeah. too long because then it starts to smell. No, that's like how you it. get the spray. You spray uh, while you're sitting? You know, the, the, nah, the, the like toilet, smell. like the poopery. And oh, the, the poopery. Yeah, yeah, you just yeah, do yeah. A couple that of, stuff does work. Yeah, it, I it light is, a match. Oh. The okay. best. Are you? No, you do not. When, yeah, you when, when I'm in public or at someone's house after I shit, I light a little bit of toilet paper on fire and put it in so it doesn't stink for the wow. next person. Wow. You've got to get the spray. They make yeah, it. Yeah, the spray. No. 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 I don't no. like the smells of that. I like but that you would amazing. It, it like you spray it on the top of the bowl mm-hmm. of the water, and it creates like a, a film. <laughs> yeah. At the top, really? That yes. protects the poop smell from ever even coming out of oh. the water. Wow. Yeah, but if you were below it, that'd be bad. Yeah, who's below the <laughs> water? Who's <laughs> scuba diving in a toilet? You, you and understand. McGregor in train spotting. <laughs> <laughs> um, suppository. Best, Wait, but wouldn't you rather just finish reading on the couch? Why do you spray to stay on there longer? Because you don't know who's coming in afterwards. You know, you got to be respectful of people. Yeah, you know, I get the spraying, yeah, gotta... but staying on there a while. No, why not? It's fun. You, you it, never know. Yeah, my I guess, dad used to I even have a I separate it. bathroom phone. Nuh uh. I do a phone. Shut up. Yeah. When I switched out phones, I <laughs> was able to keep my second one, so that's now my bathroom phone. Me. And you just connect it to Wi Fi yeah. instead of like the yeah. cellular service? <laughs> yes. Oh, that's so smart. Yeah, so, like, oh, so you way, don't get the poop that way, particles? That way I don't have to take this one. The nice one? Yeah, I keep my bathroom phone. I never think that's about so how. Funny. so smart. It's just a Nextel. 
Yeah. <laughs> it's, like a ho- <laughs> it's like a hotel with a landline next to it. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> like a bat phone for shitting. <laughs> Taking a poop. <laughs> hey, mom. So what, that ba- that phone by the toilet in, in hotels, what is the point just, of that? I don't understand. No when was ever anyone just like on a landline talking on the toilet? Just catching up, taking a long <laughs> shit. With a cord. Just <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. Where are you going? Where are you but getting, it happens. You, you see it a lot. All the time. Yeah, I, or maybe it's to call room service to eat while you're shitting. <laughs> Have you, yeah. Do you ever eat while pooping? It's a pretty big rush. No. You've never done it? I've done it oh, once, no. and I felt so terrible I about a, myself yeah. you for feel, years. You no, Why I, did you do I it? I have a kitchen burger and a, and a bathroom burger. Oh, my God. <laughs> I got two different burgers. That is wow. not the purpose. No. <laughs> <laughs> you can't have a bathroom I burger. I have a bathroom burger. Oh it's delicious. Oh, my God. No. It's delicious. I wear gloves. I think That's I've fine. trained no, myself not. to poop really fast. What kind really of life fast. do you live? Crazy. Do you... I think that girls often poop fast because we have to always, we have to pretend like we don't poop. So every time we go to the bathroom, yes. we have to like, it has to seem like we were peeing if uh, we're on like a date yes. or we're around a guy. So if you yes. go to the bathroom, it was just a tingle. So guys, I've learned to guys shit do fast. That. Guys do do that. Yeah. Like if I'm if I'm in a public place or in a restaurant, especially when the door, I hate when the door of a restaurant opens to the restaurant, like it's a single. Mm. And literally if you open the door, 900 people will see you. Oh, right. It's oh, insane. Or like when a bathroom's by the stage. Yeah. You have to like walk oh, yeah, by and terrible. everyone knows you were the guy that was shitting. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I've been in the bathroom and farted before and had girls in there like, hear me and then see me at the sink yeah. and then they look at me and I'm like I'm about to be on stage and I know you're gonna go to your table and say I just heard yeah. Nikki fart that a happened. lot Dude, this guy crazy. walked in on me shitting Oops. at UCB he opened he, he opened the door on me shitting oh and I go you know when yeah there's nothing to say yeah I just start speaking out giddy guy giddy go giddy gee I don't even know it giddy poop Gibberish. Yeah, and yeah. so I go on stage, and then but like it just was in my head that he was out there. Oh yeah. Yes. And I I was doing I was doing really well, and then like halfway through my set, I go, and where's the guy that came in on me shitting? And, <laughs> and no then, one answered. Oh no. Oh. I go, is he not here? <laughs> Nothing. And I go, oh, no. I probably shouldn't have brought that up. No. And then I just it mm. was kind of I played yeah. with it fun, but like at first it was just. It was quiet for like 20 seconds. I was like, where are you? Show yeah. yourself. So the, the one time that living in the moment didn't work. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yes. Yeah, the one time that yeah. maybe. Don't, anybody, anybody out Don't cut that yeah, tension. Okay. Let's start it again. <laughs> Let's start it again. Yeah. You're saying Who the thing in the room shit? that no one's thinking. Yeah. <laughs> it's probably just some dude that came in off the street, you know. Yeah. yeah he definitely wasn't at the show. I can't wait to see what you do tonight at your old school. Oh, dude. I don't know. I'm going to just go right into my stuff you've made me too nervous about it no i don't want to take the fun out of it for you are you, you. closing the show yeah no. i'm closing is this is a big boy coming home no <laughs> yeah. andrew goes back out after you i mean if you want to try two sets good luck hey, look, <laughs> if flowers get thrown on stage they're for your boy i know penis pumps <sighs> was this where the penis pump incident happened i mean not on stage but near it we can drive past the dorm where oh, you looked could, out the window oh my for God, a whole I could semester. Give you like you a should whole do an tour. Instagram video tour of your old college. I could show you where I burnt down the fraternity house, mm-hmm. where I got stabbed, what? where I uh, where I got caught with a penis pump, where I cried, where I ran through the rain for my girlfriend when I wrote her poetry and cried. <laughs> Uh, That's so cinematic. Yeah, it really, yeah, it is. <laughs> it really was. Was it, it a slow run? Like, how did you? I wanna... You wish. I don't uh, know. It was a drunk, drooling on myself run. That is. It was, amazing. and she saw the whole thing. She was sitting out there with another guy watching it. Oh no! Yeah, yeah. Where is he now? He's a doctor. Is he really? No, but she married a heart surgeon. Uh-huh. This girl. Mm. Yeah, but whatever. It's just hard. Is... How long did you get over? <laughs> <laughs> Just the well, if only she, he could repair yours. <laughs> uh, it was lost a long time ago. So wait, why? So do you? How long were yeah, you hung give up you a on whole that tour. girl? Uh, probably like till two years after college. Really? Maybe three. Yeah. Maybe I still look at her photos. What what, did, what made you like her so kids, much? Huh? I don't know. I just felt like I think my parents being divorced, the first girl I fell in love with, I thought I'd marry. Mm. And I was how like, long oh. were you with her? Uh, she we we're never together. <laughs> no, 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 no. We were together off and on for like three years. Oh, wow. That's a long time. Yeah. 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 Off and on being like she would break up with you and yeah. when, like the restraining why would she order would run out and huh? <laughs> have to come back. Because I'd, I'd cry a lot and I would like put oh. my tears on her cheeks. Oh. Nuh-uh. I did do that before. Like she would break up with me. I'd be oh. like, 
uh, and I'd muster out tears, and then I'd put them on her like a dog. Oh, you know? So you were, oh, I didn't know just if you were like doing like this and then just no, not smear. I was smearing face okay. to face. You just oh, that is a pathetic. Lot. A yeah, lot. yeah. And then I couldn't delete that. Mm. Yeah, you no. Can't. You, I'm. <laughs> But you're giving me so much imagery, like you running in the room. I'm just. I know. It's so I embarrassing know the things life. you do when you're, you're fir first in love, oh and the, the mistakes you make, and how much you push people away when you're just trying to keep them. Oh Mia, are you God. in a relationship right now? <laughs> I, I am. You yeah, are. Yeah, how yeah. long have you been in one? It's probably been about five years. Oh, five years. Yeah. That's a wow. lot. Wow! Congratulations. Yeah, thanks. You know, we try. And um, can I ask about it? How did you guys meet? Yeah, yeah. Do you live together? No, we do not live together, but we actually met in high school. Whoa. But we didn't date back then. Yeah. So, yeah, we just always, we were friends. And my little sister, when she was about five, she used to always ask why he wasn't my boyfriend when I, when she was a kid. And she'd Aww. go, I love him. He should be your boyfriend. And and then years later, she's like, it's happening. It's finally wow. happening. So, yeah. cute. so she's very proud. So you guys reconnected on Facebook or something like that? Just uh, Let me see. We, because um, this is the thing, and he swears he does not remember this at all. But mm. in like the early 2000s, he, want, he called me and he's like, oh, I like you. And then I was like, no, you don't. And I don't like you, so why are you telling me this? And then we stopped talking for a while. Was this in college? Or this was, was this, yeah, uh, this was I've, like, this, yeah, this was probably, this was maybe, yeah, around a okay. little bit after. And then um, a few months later, he got married. Wow. And then Did I you know he so was So you guys engaged? had been close friends? <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, I'm this is like, like, no, no, no. Like, we, like, we have been hanging out and talking all the time. And then he's like, oh, I like you. And then maybe, you know, maybe like six months after that, one of my friends she heard, she's like, oh, did you know he got married? And I went, no, I had no idea. No, he wasn't oh. dating anybody. Like I, he, right. He's in the military, and I feel like they accelerate relationships. Mm -hmm. And so um, then we didn't talk for a little while, and then we found each other again on MySpace. Right. And then I'm like, oh, like where have you been? And he's like, where have you been? And that's how we became friends again. But by that time, he was in another relationship. I was in a relationship. I was engaged, and wow, yeah. And then somewhere along the lines, in like the past five years, we're like, oh, when like, he put you in the top sixteen on his MySpace. <laughs> that's top that's eight. when everything changed. <laughs> that's I was like, I'm top eight. So, Yo, damn. Uh, but no, that's how we reconnected yeah. as friends. Where we're like, oh my god, where have you been? And then um, we'd always just chat back and forth. He'd even. When I was shacking up with the guy I was engaged to, he even once came to Atlanta and stayed with us for a few days. Like, oh, I'm going to be in town. Like, can I crash at your house? And I'm like, oh, wow. sure you can. Wow. And then the guy that I was engaged to, he told me after he left, he went, by the way, I don't know if you know this, but your friend likes you. And if you and I are not together, he's going to try to date you. And I wow. said, no, he's not. I said, no, he would never do that. And then I went, oh, no, he was right. Whoa. Oh, yeah. So cute. Yeah, and so crazy. did you yeah. both move up here together? Oh, he's in D.C. Oh, he's, yeah, in, he's DC. in D.C. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, okay. I'm so how, how did you bridge from just being like pals and everything to being like, I, I, let's do this? You know what? One day, because we always had, we always talked a lot. And mm -hmm. then we just started talking all the time, but it would be for hours. And then mm -hmm. one day I went, oh, no, am I feeling things in this cold, dead heart of mine? Mm -hmm. And I went, <laughs> I'm feeling. And then he's like. Do we like each other? I went, oh my God, I think we like each other. And then we started like visiting each other. And yeah. then I went, oh no. And then he sent me a picture of his penis and I was like, I'm in. And wow. then um, he sent you a picture before you guys hooked up? No, well, yeah, because what, what happened. Yeah, well, so what happened? Can we see it? Jackson. I, I always tell people, and this is true, like I missed the dick pic boom of the mid early, you know, like 2000s mm -hmm. because I was in another relationship. So. He was like, I'll send you a pic just to, you know, get it going. And yeah. I'm like, thank you. Like, hopefully now I'll get flooded with dicks. Mm. And then um, he sent one, and I went, this is a good one. Was it on your bathroom phone? No, this is before I had a bathroom <laughs> phone. This is before the bathroom phone. <laughs> what kind of dick? And, what good dick? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. And I went, I went, oh, then I went, I'm going to send a picture back. Oh, what did you send? I said, I, had, I, went and, I went and got a good bra. And then I had my friend help I me. I got a good, you went and bought it. Yeah. You didn't yeah. have a good Yeah, sometimes you got to do that. <laughs> yes. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. And I had my um my BFF. She's like, let's get this picture. And so I'm all like posing and she framed me nice. up. And then I went, here you go. And so that's how. And that's how it happened. That's how I got wow. into, yeah. yeah. That's wild to yeah. like yeah. go from friends and then all of a sudden your friend is sending you a dick pic. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. I saw Ian's dick. Um, and then you oh, sent him yeah. your tits? Kind of. 
<laughs> kind of. Not what? all of it. You saw it from behind. Yeah. Of so course. Ian, I did not want to see Ian's penis. I mean, kind of. I mean, I'm not going to uh, lie. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Why not? Like, yeah. If someone's yeah. willing to show, and you're close to them, like I, it's kind of interesting. I wasn't ready for it. I thought because Ian does this thing <laughs> where he'll always be like, "Hey Nikki, I just got this new um, pillow that everyone's talking about. I should get," and he'll show me a picture of a woman's head resting on a penis. <laughs> like he'll just he always he never shows you what he you think you're gonna see. He'll be like, "Here's a picture of my grandfather." And, you know, it's just oh, mm. that is great. Um, and so I wasn't ex- actually expecting your penis, but then he was like, "Here's my penis," but it was um, but I didn't feel. Um, um, threatened violated. by it, violated by it, because mm. it was a, a picture that he often sends on Grinder. I'm thinking yes. it was more of like a, a mm. one for men. Yeah, it was a it dick was pic a for men me as opposed from to me behind, or for and a my, woman. My wang was hanging down, oh, so it was yes. artistic. Yeah, so you could see it from behind. Okay. So you didn't see the whole penis. Okay. You saw just kind of. You like, see the balls? Was, like, was it a shadow? No, it oh, was like the... it was like if 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 okay. I stood and you looked at me naked from behind, you'd okay. see my yeah, so balls the... and okay. penis hanging down. Yeah, so it was kind of like, oh, what's on the other side, uh, you know? So okay. then they want to see more, and then I hit them with the other one. Yes, oh, it's a mystery. You know? Yes. Yeah. <gasps> so I appreciated it, and I didn't feel weird about it because it was like, oh, this is. But how did it come the gay up? Side did you do the, the fake out? No, because no, I think we were talking about someone else's boyfriend's penis showing a dick pic and I was like let me see it and then mm. we ended up talking and then it was like should we see Ian's dick and I was like yeah, yeah, I don't know. yeah okay. why not well, whatever it happens sometimes Andrew okay. I showed Ian my kind of my dick the oh other yeah day. I really? helped him out with his balls in the bathroom of an yeah. au bon palm what yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah you don't know that <laughs> yeah yeah he thought he had herpes so I gave a oh. look oh. so he blew me to get it off <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> Oh, this I was is... like, I'll suck it out of you. So yeah, you, he did, and you now can, you rec- you you're able to recognize herpes on site. He yeah, wears just... glasses. Those are herpes glasses. Yeah. Oh, this... I feel like I'm very. I, I get tested all the time. I'm very like health conscious with sexuality, so I feel like I oh. kind of no one can recognize stuff. And so, how did this how did this all lead to you going to was, an Obama? You were at lunch. Him, and you, I was we like, were at lunch with that? you, and I was freaking out, and I thought that I thought this girl gave me herpes because I had like a follicle thing. Mm. Make it, you make had grown hair. hair. Yeah, but I didn't know because okay. it definitely didn't look kosher. <laughs> uh, and I'm Jewish, and that's just you don't want that. You don't want ham on your balls. Yeah, the balls weren't blessed. Uh, ham, ham piece. It just looked oh, bad. Yeah. God. Yeah, and um, so I was freaking out, and I just felt like Ian's seen a lot of herpes in his life. Just look at him, and uh, and so, <laughs> <laughs> hey, you have herpes head. You are a herpes. <laughs> you won't go away. Oh, <laughs> every month. So I end up asking him to. I I think you offered. I, don't I was know. like, I'll take a look. Let me see. Yeah, yeah. that is so. And sweet. It, it wasn't like a herpy. What did just... you say to him? And it didn't put him at ease, though. You it still did, spiraled, it did, it right? Did. A little Remember? bit, but and it then did we, help. We hugged at the subway, yeah. and I held you. <laughs> it was a really tight. It was a really bonding moment. Was it really? Yeah, showing yeah. STDs to your friends could really like. I remember bring you. my but one friend. But it wasn't friend. herpes, by the way. No. It was. I'm just right. throwing that out there. My one friend. You can't get it twice. My one friend um, <laughs> <laughs> thought she had herpes. And she's freaking out about it. And I was just like, can I just see? Because I gen- yeah. genuinely think that you don't have it. But like, let's just see. So she dropped trow in front of me in my living room. And her vagina was so perfect oh and like God. tiny. Yes. And like her little, like it was just. Why did she think she had herpes though? It was like, it was maybe like a an ingrown hair t- type yeah, situation. Okay. Literally, it was nothing. She was wildly, like, mm. I couldn't even see what she was talking about. All I saw was a perfect vagina. Like a little rabbit's nose. And I got so, <laughs> me- I was just like, I hope you have herpes. I, it depressed yeah. me so yeah. much to see such a good vagina. I was so sad and mad because <laughs> I was like, they are out there. I'm not, yeah. I'm not crazy. Mine doesn't look like this. And, um, and I haven't talked to her since. Yeah. Um, just, that's a lie. But no, I, I, I'm still friends with her. But I, like I really don't. I don't appreciate when women's vaginas are. Per- I don't want to see. Like if, if you looked at Andrew's yeah, penis and it was humongous, yeah, yeah. right? He'd be like, "Fuck you, dude." Well, right? I'd be like, "Well, I mean, it makes sense because that's why he hasn't worked on his personality." Right. Right. <laughs> yeah, you would think I'd have a great cock. 
Yeah, just based on Joke's your personality. Jokes on you. Jokes on all of you. Um, no, if Andrew had a good pipe, I'd be like, yeah, good for you. I didn't show him the pipe. I showed him like next to the pipe. It was just the skin on the He balls. like covered oh. everything and held it like okay. like a monkey brain. I have to say yeah. as a woman that is like newly kind of single and, and not newly single, but like <laughs> putting myself out there, hooking up. And I, and I did a lot of like... I've talked a lot about my vagina insecurities and like how I feel like it's, you know, I did a whole special practice. I've done two specials where I talk about it a lot. And, um, and I feel like, and I've always, I never said that I love my vagina. I've never said that like, now I love it and it's who I am. I don't feel that way. It's still not what I would want it to be. I still want to get like surgery at some point because it, I just would like it to be like, just nothing. Like, I just want it to be nothing. I don't think I'm going to get surgery, but it's not where I want it to be. And um, and I get nervous hooking up. I get super nervous still, and I, I didn't realize that about myself. I had to, like, kind of admit that to myself, that I still have super anxiety. My anxiety used to be that a man would see my vagina and, like, be like, ugh, what the fuck, and, like, abandon me. Mm -hmm. That, I know men don't do that. I have never been met with that. But is that, that why you would drink it? To like forget to, about to, to the be vagina. like yeah to to get over the nerves of a guy touching my vagina. If yeah. I had a, if I had a perfect vagina, you I would, would be yeah. the biggest slut ever. I swear to God, it would. My life would be completely different. Your vagina different. is imperfectly perfect. Yeah, I mean, anyone who it's loves beautiful. me is gonna love my vagina. It's mm -hmm. it's actually pretty fucking and great. Also, but I feel, like a lippy vagina about... is great because I love having did, stuff in my mouth. Did you say lippy? Yeah. Did you... Okay. Just... Yeah, <laughs> like mine. Mine gets an attitude. Sure. I felt that way about my. <laughs> Oh. Mine will make, mouth off. I just wanted to make <laughs> mouthy vagina. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> shut the fuck up or I'll shut you up. Clean your room. <laughs> but I still like I I realize like the idea of hooking up with someone is like stresses me out so much because I am so scared they're gonna be like I don't want to be with this person with this vagina for the rest of my life. Women are so it's so like, guys do I feel that like, too. I know. I do. Yeah. I, 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 That's I why I feel like complimenting your genitals during interactions is like really good mm, for the other person. That's. And even I agree you with you. you know? I really love yeah. hearing my vagina's awesome. Yeah. Because and not I'm just so like you're so it. tight, you're so tight, but like that's well, that's great, like, right? Yeah, no, it's great. Yeah, yeah. I mean, but, you're not a woman, so you don't know what it means right. to hear Change that you're up. tight. It feels great, it, right? I mean, yes. That's what you want to hear. Over and over and over and over. Like, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You're, you're like, I've been doing some work. Yeah. You, you're like, thank you for mm. noticing my progress. But yeah. sometimes yeah. it makes you come fast because yeah. you're so excited about how tight it is. Well, let me uh, let us know. Still, I don't yeah. care if you come fast. I'm gonna I'd rather come hear quick because you're tight, yeah. pussy. Um, but if a girl said you got a monster cock to me, I'd be like, you're a liar. Yeah, I'd be like, honey, the Oscars were last I wouldn't, month. I wouldn't <laughs> quit acting. Like, yeah, shut your lippy mouth. Yeah, that's why I used to, I have, I closed my special with, um, my special Perfect on Comedy Central from two years ago with a whole bit about telling my boyfriend that his dick was so big. Mm -hmm. And he just goes, oh, please, yeah. come on. <laughs> no, it's not. And I'm like, yes, it is. And he's like. You you can't lie to me. It's fine, but it's not big. And so, I in my special, I I said that women, you need to say that uh, you can't say it's big if they they'll know, but you can't be like it's so fucking average. Like, what do you say about? Yeah. yeah what do you want to hear about your penis, Andrew? It's good if, looking. It's a good looking. Look dick? cool in a leather Handsome. coat, maybe. Wait, yeah. does it? Is that what? Yeah. Seriously, if, what is the oh. best thing a woman? Because you don't have a it's monster per, cock, right? No, I'm a monster cock, but I don't. I don't have a micro penis. Right. But but it's 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 average. Yeah, it could use a little bit more weight. I think. So what is what's the best thing you can hear that isn't going to be a lie from a woman? What's the best compliment you can receive about your penis that isn't big? I would love to know. It hits all my right spots. Okay. Something like that, or it's like it's perfect for my pussy, like. I yeah, it's just, it hits just the clit. We can fuck you multiple a, times in a day. I'll be fine. <laughs> you have a goldy dick. It's not too big. It's not too small. It's just right. Oh, oh okay. yeah, like porridge. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's just <laughs> like porridge. Like, and mama's hungry. <laughs> room temperature porridge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A guy porridge. loves to hear that about his dick. Oh, it's funny. The guys with like the huge dicks porridge. are like, he's this... always flashing. Or he's always, like all the flash would always have giant. Yeah, because he was a giant cock. You know what I mean? Like oh, all the are... guys that were always like, he's always showing his dick. But I Ian, used to whip my dick answer? out all the time. Did you? I, I, but you have a big dick. Just so fun. Well, you've seen his dick. 
I don't remember how big it is. Well, though. you can see his cock from behind. It's pretty nice. So you've got a big dick. So I'm, your I don't best know if it's compliment like big, you can hear. But it's all right. Mia, what's the best compliment a guy can give you in bed? And not just about your vagina in general. Uh, let's go. Let's go round robin. Best see. compliment you can get <laughs> in bed. What can I get? Oh God. If a man. What do it, I- if your bo- if your boyfriend's mm. listening right now and you Let's would see. like him to reiterate something a little bit more, uh, what I would you want? Stuff like like I love who you are. Yeah, yeah I think I want maybe maybe like, I want personality. Uh, I've never seen two women uh, dry up more. Yeah, than I, I know you guys really didn't I like that. That was I ridiculous. I, I know. I, I know. Love you so my vagina just dropped I'm, sixteen yeah, I centimeters. I don't, yeah, I I don't know if I yeah you would, I don't know if I want a, a personality. Like I don't want somebody to be like. I feel your soul. What about when you make like, like, you like, you like, like, trying to make love? <laughs> you're such a no, good writer. No, don't say make love. That's what? gross. But I've gotten Did in trouble say for make saying love? you're my lover and I want to make love. No. That's cute. Uh. Don't say make love. No, it is kind of gross. I, it, it you don't me, want to make love it makes sometimes? so ill. No. No, no I, I, I've actually, slow. I really, I, <laughs> it used to gross me out and I totally get where you're coming from. I am done. I, that is... That's the next step for me is I want to be in a relationship and I want to make love, which is uh, pain right? for me to say. Yeah, like, I'm so into but you. But it is the goal to make love, oh, like to actually I... have a connected, mm. intimate experience mm-hmm. of like where it feels like we're making love. One time, yeah. I, but oh, let me just let's let's complete our circle yeah. of um, best thing you could hear. For me, I'll get it started. Um, you make me anyone, feel whole. Mm, <laughs> My ex boyfriend used uh, to say, This is my favorite place to be. Would oh, be wow. like inside. He's oh. like, Nothing has ever felt this good. And he's slept around a lot. And he's uh-huh. like, No vagina has ever felt as good as yours or yeah. will ever feel as good as yours. There's something extremely special about your vagina. Like, to make me feel like n- I'm special. Like, that it's not just like a compliment that other girls could receive, it's one right. that only I could receive. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That, that made me feel mm. amazing. And um, uh, just yeah, that's that was probably the best feeling that I could get, or just like a guy like being like, "You're so fucking beautiful," like just being almost yeah. disgusted with how hot you are. Yeah, like yeah. what the fuck? Yeah. Like offended by it? <laughs> yeah, that's a, no, that's a that's good, a good yeah. one. No, yeah, that that yeah, that's what I want. That's yeah, a, okay, yeah. good. Yeah, that's what I want to hear. All right, yeah, I know. Ian. Yeah. What? What do you want to hear in bed? One time I heard. Uh, your dick's hitting the back of my pussy walls. And I was like, that's <laughs> the that's back a, of your pussy That's a weird way to talk. Did you like it? I mean, it it, it kind of weirded me out. Like, because then I just like pictured like a dick with a blindfold on running into a wall. <laughs> 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 just, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like he forgot his walking stick and he's just smashing his head into a wall like a dumb dick. <laughs> like when I play video games with a, yeah. a guy. Just, like, in yeah, the you're like playing virtual reality. Yeah. Just, like moving around. <laughs> Give me that dumb dick. Mm-hmm. Um, Andrew? I mean, I kind of said it before uh, that I hit the Just right spot. Just hitting all the right spots. That's a good, yeah. That is a great compliment. If women are listening right now and your boyfriend does not have a monster dick, just telling him that it hits in all the right spots because then that's going to give him the security that you don't need a big dick to hit the right spots. And that well, is true. Like, your cock is so big is hot. Like I know, but if it's cock. not big, but right. it, yours is. Yeah, but so it that can feels feel. Good. No, but anyone's cock can feel big in a tight space. What, but but you can't say it is big. You can say it feels big, which sounds like a joke. Mm. Your cock feels you know what so I love? big. I, you really I, lean into feels. Thank you so much for watching that clip that you just watched. Did you enjoy it? I hope you did. If you did, thumbs up it. Why don't you subscribe? Why don't you just keep watching more videos? Let them play. Share with your friends. Go share on your Instagram story. Go, just have a great day.